Good morning. Thank you for joining us from the International Space Station Flight Control Room at the Johnson Space Center in Houston, Texas. We're live in the Mission Control Center where the Orbit 2 team, or second shift, is on duty working with the crew. The team is being led by Flight Director Jerry Jason and supported by Leslie Ringo and astronaut Doug Wheelock, both serving as CAPCOMs for the shift. On orbit, the crew is busy at work. It is the afternoon of the workday for the Expedition 36 crew of NASA astronauts Chris Cassidy and Karen Nyberg, European Space Agency astronaut Luca Parmitano, and Russian cosmonauts Alexander Masurkin, Fyodor Yurchikin, and Commander Pavel Vinogradov. The crew's been busy since their wake up. Their morning activities included work with the urine tank processing as well as exercise for the commander. He's also performed some uh, cleaning of the Russian segment panel vent screens. His counterparts, Yurchikin and Misurkin, donned their Russian Orlan spacesuits in the pier's docking compartment this morning and checked out all of their gear in preparation for their spacewalk Friday, where they will rig fig. Uh, cables for the future launch of a Russian laboratory module and install an experiment panel on the Poisk module. Cassidy spent most of his morning working on the water recovery system sample analysis using the TOCA or the Total Organic Carbon Analyzer. His counterpart, Luca Parmitano, has uh, been working on the continued unpacking of the cargo that was transferred up in the HTV-4. He's uh, been working on that most of the morning and continuing that work into the afternoon. Meanwhile, fellow astronaut Karen Nyberg assisted with the HTV unpack and also conducted an interview with the Today Show. She's also been working on the multi-purpose small payload rack combustion chamber hardware in the Kibo module. This will be used for future experiment work. After a midday meal break, Cassidy again resumed uh, work checking out the water separa uh, separator units in his U.S. spacesuit and Parmitano's U.S. spacesuit. Water intrusion into Parmitano's helmet during the last, last spacewalk resulted in a premature termination of that last EVA, which was uh, conducted on July 16th. That resulted in an ongoing troubleshooting and an inquiry by a mishap investigation board. Cassidy also has a health maintenance system on-orbit hearing assessment planned later this afternoon, and cosmonauts will continue with the Russian segment maintenance and spacewalk preparations. Astronaut Karen Nyberg will also continue her work on the multi-purpose small payload rack combustion chamber. Again, uh, that will be used for future experiment operations. All of the crew members have exercise planned in the afternoon, with each having at least two hours of exercise planned. They'll wrap up their day with a daily planning conference shortly after 2 p.m. Central Time. After some off-duty time for their evening meal and personal time, they will have uh, a bit of rest before crew sleep, which is scheduled for 4.30 p.m. Central Time. 